In this video, we're going to be battling the Shining Fate TTB against the Viv Voltage GTB. Let's see which one has the best pulls. Let's get into the video. So there are a few subtle differences between the two. Uh, so firstly, Shining Fate has 10 packs and the Viv Voltage only has 8. Uh, the Shining Fates also has the promo card in, which I don't remember there being a promo card in Viv Voltage. Uh, so there are a few things that obviously go against it. Uh, we will do a standard pack battle. I do have some extra booster packs from Viva Voltage if we do need to try and give uh, the Viva Voltage a little bit of a hand up. Maybe we'll throw two more in and do 10v10. Uh, but let's see, can the Viva Voltage beat it even without those two extra ones? So yeah, let's get into the video. What I'm going to do is I'll open both up um, and then we'll, we'll kind of pull all the cards and things out that we need. Um, I always struggle to open things, but hopefully we can get into them quite easily. So, Shining Fate TTB, I opened up one of these recently and fortunately pulled the Charizard, so I am one for one on the Charizard. Uh, this comes with a standard booklet to obviously your collector's booklet. And inside, standard divider, uh, rule book, promo card. The last one was off cut massively and this one does not look any different it looks very off cut um yeah not good at all and then energy some dividers and a cone card dividers um, sleeves I need to start using some of these sleeves uh, obviously the standard tokens that come with the etbs and then finally 10 packs of Shining Fate. Next up is the Viv Voltage. Um, I think this was, it was, I did a Viv Voltage boost pack opening, and I think this was one of the first things I actually opened up on my channel, so if you've not seen that, go check it out. Um, so it's actually, I've been a really, really long time since I actually opened up one of these. So um, yeah, I've only ever opened one of them. Um, I always like the, the artwork that's inside of these as well. So if you've never seen the artwork inside, you can actually peel these open. Um, and there's some quite interesting artwork in there as well. And Shiny Fates is the same. So yeah, if you've not seen that, check that out. Uh, same as the Shining Fates one, just a uh, standard collector's book. And inside, divider as before, a rule book, some tokens as before, same dividers, uh, energy, sleeves, and code card. And then in terms of packs, I'm pretty certain it's eight, but let's just double check. Two, four, yeah, so it's eight packs. So uh, it is a little bit of a disadvantage on Viva Voltage. Uh, when you compare price to price, the Viva Voltage one, you don't get anywhere near as much value for money. Um, so the Viva Voltage ones, I think they retail about 50 pounds, so it's 52.50 in the UK. Um, that comes with 10 packs and a promo. That's really, really strong value for money. Whereas you compare the Viv Voltage, which I think retail for about the same. They may be a little bit less, about 42, 45, something like that. Uh, but you do get a lot less packs and you don't get a promo. So yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. I feel like uh, Shining Fate is a lot stronger than the, the Viv Voltage. But let's get into it. So we're gonna do a pack battle side by side. Um, I've never done a pack battle before. Obviously I'm not putting them against each other, but uh, yeah. Let's see what we can pull from each one. There's more of the Shining Fate, so we'll start with that. Um, and then we'll go one, 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 one. Uh, and we'll try and stack up the pulls next to each other as well. Um, I'll try and go fairly quickly with these, because obviously uh, it's 18 packs essentially, so it's half a booster box. Um, but I'll try and go fairly quickly with them. And code cards. And four from the back with Shining Fate. Same with the Voltage. And let's go uh, Darkness. Ah. Never mind, I'll get there eventually. Yanma, Morpeko, Eevee, Glossifleur, Yanma, Professor's Research, Reverse Hollow, and a Hollow and DD. Nice. So in uh, a Hollow in the first one, um, not too bad. We will put the uh, uh, Reverse Hollows down as well. Uh, but in a Hollow and DD to start, not terrible. The Voltage, see what we can pull. We still <laughs> have nothing good to show for from uh, Viv Voltage, we've not had much luck with them. Let's see if we can uh, try and improve that today. Uh, let's go grass. If it was grass and grass, that would've been pretty cool, uh, but never mind. Uh, Wooper, Dedene, Pepec, Pepec, 
Pikapek, Tutel, a Rayalu, Flareon, that was a reverse holo actually. Um, I didn't even notice that that was a reverse holo. And a standard rare Grackalot. So, first pack, 100% goes to the Shining Fates. Pack two, uh, Shining Fates again. Let's see what we can pull. If we can get into it. Which, why is this pack? Well, that one didn't open too well, did it? Um, go card, if I could move my thumb. Four from the back. And I didn't guess, but never mind. I'll remember next time. Bull Guy, Team Yell Towel, Nickit, Cacnea. Qfant, Eevee, Buzel. Okay, nice. A shiny Sizzlepeed and a Professor's Research. So, so far, Shining Fates is running away with it, shall we say. Uh, the Sizzlepeed, absolutely uh, a nice shiny to go, go against the whatever we can try and pull from Shining Fates. So, let's see what we can get in Shining... Uh, not Shining Fates. See what we can pull in uh, Viv Voltage. And Code Card. Four from the back. Let's go Lightning. Damn it. Rocky Helmet, Alistair, Tang, Charmander, Wooper, Meowth, Cottony, Aracuda, a Reverse Hollow Loud Dread, and is there something to go against two pulls so far in Shining Fates? No, a standard rare Al Creepy. That's quite a cool artwork though, I've not seen that before. Really cool artwork. So far, two pulls from the Shining Fates nothing from Viva Voltage. This is what I expect. Viva Voltage has been so nasty to me, uh, whereas Shining Fates, it just seems to be pull after pull after pull. So yeah, it looks like at the moment my thoughts are right that Shining Fates is where I'm lucky and Viva Voltage isn't. Things could change. Let's get into pack three. So pack three, and let's see what we can pull. Um, I do have a 100% record, like I said, in uh, for pulling a Charizard from an ETB. It'd be nice to keep that record up, but I'm not too hopeful. Let's go Fire. Okay, maybe. Uh, Rotom, Floatzel, Tropius, Grookey, Spinarak, Shinx, Horsey, Yanma. Nice! Shiny Snom and a Boss's Orders. But that is another pull. So once again, Shining Fates, 100% pull rate from these three packs so far, whereas the Vivid Voltage, I'm still yet to pull anything. We still do have, what, another six packs though, so let's see if we can pull something here. And code card. Let's go Lightning. Fire again. So we're still waiting for a pull from Viva Voltage. Is this the pack? Rockruff, Taylor, Yanma, a reverse holo Mightyana, and come on. <laughs> Is there something in here? No pulls so far. No pulls continues. Why are the why is Viva Voltage? Viva Voltage hates me. I swear. I don't know why, but it just nothing from Viva Voltage. This is a 3-0 slaughter by Shining Fates at the moment. Let's get into the next one. So pack number four, still not a single pull from Viva Voltage. Still waiting to hit anything. Um, and obviously the three pulls so far from Shining Fates has just been hit after hit after hit. Uh, let's see if that can continue. And code card. And let's go grass. There. Dartrix, Gym Trainer, Nickit, Horsey, Snom, Morpeko, uh, Cacnea. <laughs> Why are these Shining Fates, man? Vivid Voltage is awful to me, and Shining Fates, it just seems to be one after the other after the other. Gossifleur, Shiny, nice. And again, a Hollow Boom, a uh, Rilla Boom, Hollow. Uh, this is about the fourth or fifth pull of, of Rilla Boom that I've pulled, so sorry for not being so excited. Um, but again, it's another pull. Four packs, five pulls, <laughs> Vivid Voltage just over there like, ooh. <laughs> One of these pulls from Vivid Voltage, man, they, they actually crack me up. Anyway, uh, let's see if we can, uh, it can redeem itself. Watch there be a Pikachu in here now and it just slaughter everything. Um, but it's not looking, looking likely at the moment, shall we say, so uh, code card. 
and let's go, let's go water. Ah, psychic. Hit him on top, Crocorock, Delmise, Trubbish, Tynamo, Clavopus, a Woobat, a Taylo, a Reverse Hollow Slugma. Hey, nice! Uh, a Hollow Trainer in Leon. We don't have this, we haven't seen this yet. That is a nice pull, we'll take that, we need that, so um, I'm pretty happy with that, that's not too bad. Um, yeah, it's good. But even though that is pull from the hollow, it was against a shiny and a hollow pull, so I'm still going to give that to the Shining Fates. Um, I mean, that's four packs in and it's 4-0 for Shining Fates. There's only four packs remaining for Viva Voltage to actually try and get this. So at best Viva Voltage is going to get a draw. It may need some help for some extra booster packs just to even get close. Uh, but at the moment it's, it's not even nearly going to win. Um, there's going to have to be a Pikachu in here to try and redeem itself. But at the moment Shining Fates has got it. Let's get into pack five. Uh, let's see if we can continue that luck. And code card. Let's go uh, fight. Ah, darkness. Tropius, Gym Trainer, Luxio, Fruki, Spinarak, Shinx, Horsey, Yamma. Oh my god. <laughs> Shining Fates, man, is actually killing it. It's so good. Uh, we don't have the Kyogre yet. Amazing rare. Viva Voltage, you're going to have to pull your finger out here. This is actually crazy. Um, there is still one more card, and it is a... Nice, a more Peko V. So again, it's another two pulls for Shining Fates. Um, let's put them down, down there. Let's see if Viva Voltage has any answer to this absolute onslaught. Um, it's not even comparable, is it? Let's see if we can pull anything. Um, let's get into the Viva Voltage one. Code card. And let's go water. Nope. Natang, Magiana, Beauty, Wubat, Aracuda, C Dot, a Fanfi, Shuffer, a Reverse Hollow Metagross. I slipped. A Reverse Hollow Metagross and a, a Galarian Dimension V Max. This is a nice card, but we do already have it. Um, so that kind of puts it down a little bit. Um, but again, it was a single VMAX pull against an amazing rare and a V. So again, Shining Fates takes it. It's not even close. Um, yeah, I literally don't know where, where the bleeding stops. I mean, you know, we need a paramedic. Yeah, this is it's getting a little bit out of control. That's a 5-0 win and a comfortable win for Shining Fates. There is no coming back for Vim Voltage now. Uh, but let's see if there is something, if there's a Pikachu in here. Maybe. Imagine if we get to the last pack and pull a Pikachu and then we get to the 10th pack in there and get a Charizard. That would like, be, it'd be fixed now if it actually came true, but, uh, or it'd look fixed at least, but yeah, that would be a little bit crazy. Um, let's go with Darkness. Ah, gross. Might be nearly. Um, Coughing, Gossifleur, Cacnea, uh, Tutel, Eevee, a Reverse Hollow Grokey, and a, hey! Finally, no pull for the uh, Shining Fates. I mean, I'm not too disappointed given the amount of pulls we've already got. So six pulls from six packs. Uh, sorry, I can't even count. Seven pulls from six packs. Um, yeah, well, I'll take that all day long. Still, bit of voltage. Come on. Need life support, man. Let's see if there's anything in here. And code card. And let's go fire. Nope. Duot, Aromatic Energy, Heroes Medal, Chimeco, Ninkeda, Voltorb, Rockruff. I just have no faith in the Voltage anymore. I don't know why, but I, I just... <sighs> Wishma, a Reverse Hollow Pinchurchin, and a... a Colossal V. Nice, it's another pull. It is another pull that we have, so it's obviously a common pull, uh, but it is another pull. Um, that does give... Vivid Voltage, one point. So we are six packs in. It's currently 5-1, uh, given that we didn't pull anything in that last one. And the one that won was a Colossus V. Or oh, Colossal V, sorry, which is not the most exciting card, and we already have it. So, yeah, I mean, if you can count that as a win, then great. Uh, let's go on, carry on. Let's go on to uh, the next one for Shining Fate. See if we can pull anything.
code. And let's go fighting energy. Lightning. Gym trainer, Thwacky, float soul, spinnerack, fusel, rowlet, trap inch, snob. There's another pull. A shiny stunfish and a ditto VMAX. Nice. I really, really like this card. It's absolutely sick artwork. Um, full art. Nice. It's not the most exciting Pokemon, but the artwork on it's really, really sick. Uh, in terms of centering, uh, I'll try and show it. Looks really, really good, really clean. On the back doesn't look too bad either. Look like a bit of whitening there, but it looks fine. Yeah, looks good. Another pull, another two pulls actually, from Vivivolt uh, from Shining Fates. Vivi Voltage literally cannot do anything to answer this. There has to be a Pikachu V Max in here, Rainbow, for there to be any shot of Vivi Voltage pulling this out. It's not looking likely, let's put it that way. Let's get into the Vivi Voltage pack, pack number seven. Is there any answer? Is there any hope? I'm not sure what could be pulled here to beat a Ditto V Max and a Stunfish Shiny. Um, there's not many cards in that could be in here that's potentially going to beat that. Let's go with Grass. Nope. I'm getting closer. Or well, maybe not. Clavopus, uh, Electric, Execute, uh, Eevee, uh, Reverse Hollow Nosleaf. Is there any answer? Is there a Pikachu? <sighs> what is it? What is Vivid Voltage? I mean, is, is Vivid Voltage even real? Is it even real? <laughs> What is Vivid Voltage, man? Okay, 7 1 to, to Shining Fates. It's not even close. Uh, sorry, 6 1 to Shining Fates. Not even close. Vivid Voltage, you were my first love. First one back. And you just do me like this, man. It's not good. Let's go ahead and carry on. Shining Fates is already comfortably won. Let's see if there's anything left in here. Maybe we can pull the Shining Charizard and maybe say that it was just the, a really stacked ETB. But it's not looking good for Viv Voltage. Let's go fighting. Oh, yes. Rusted Sword, Sword, uh, Bull Guy, Thraki, Spinarak, Shinx, Horsey, Yanma, Morpeko, Team Yellow Towel, a Reverse Hollow. I always struggle with this. Team Yellow Towel, Reverse Hollow. That's too many words. And a standard Yamega. Okay, so Viv Voltage has a shot. There is a chance that Viv Voltage might win the last pack. It's not got much to go up against. It's a Team Hill Towel Reverse Hollow. Um, this is the last pack. Let's see if there's anything good in here. So the only thing that wins this is a Pikachu. So let's go in. It's not in. Let's see if there's anything in there. Oh, is that a shiny, maybe? Ooh, maybe there is. A bay, Wooper, Dedene, Pikapek, Tutel, Rylu, Reverse Hollow Meta, Metang. This is your only chance for voltage. You've got one shot. Don't let me down. Oh my God. Vivid Voltage, man! Oh, what is this, Vivid Voltage? What is this? Is, is it just me? Is it is it literally just me? I just... I'm at... So, before we open the last two Shining Fates packs, we got two hollows three shinies, four shinies, sorry, an amazing rare, a V and a VMAX from Shining Fates in six packs against one hollow, a V and a VMAX. It's just not fair, is it? <laughs> what is these vivid voltage pulls? So we got two more for Shining Fates. Let's open them up quickly and see what's in here. Um, if anything, go card. Uh, let's go fire. Oh, hello. Okay. This could be interesting. Shinx, coughing, horsey, croaky, or peco. Nice! Toxic, tox, 
Toxtricity V. Um, not a card we've got, but it's nice to pull that. And a Decidueye Hollow. That's pretty awesome. Nice, we'll take them. Um, final pack from Shining Fates. Let's see what the last pack holds. Is it a Charizard to maintain our 100% strike rate on ETBs and Charizards? Let's go. And my battery died. <laughs> so we'll show it on this camera. Hopefully you can get the focus. Uh, so metal. So we're going to have to do this like this. It's going to be a little bit interesting because I'm watching it on the monitor here. Uh, Float, so is that? Yeah. I can't actually see it, so I'm just going to go through. Let's see what's in here. Trap Inch, Snom, Grokey, a Reverse Hollow. I can't actually see what that is. Shinx. Standards are rude. Well, that wasn't too bad. Camera died on the last one. Apologies for that. But to summarize, yeah, I mean, it's not even comparable, is it? Um, we got the four shinies from uh, Shining Fates. We got three hollows, one amazing rare, two Vs and a VMAX. And yeah, Vivid Voltage is just looking very lonely over there. So yeah, not ideal. So that's going to about do it for this video. It was a little bit something different. I know that Shining Fates obviously has a lot more special cards in it, a lot more shinies and things. So I know that it was a little bit weighted towards Shining Fates. I didn't expect it to be such a bloodbath towards uh, Shining Fates. Um, it absolutely killed it in terms of uh, the competition. I think it finished 7-1 in the end. Vu Voltage only picked up a single one, and that was because there wasn't a hollow in that one from Shining Fates. So. Yeah, I know it wasn't necessarily apples and pears or, you know, kind of equal, um, but yeah, it's, uh, I thought it was just an interesting battle. And it, it's also a huge reflection on how well I'm doing in Shining Fates and how badly I do in Voltage. So yeah, it was nice to put my kids to each other. I have loads more Shining Fates and Vivid Voltage stuff to do, including six booster boxes from Vivid Voltage, loads of Pikachu boxes, including another five ETBs from Shining Fates, tins, um, the, the mini tins, lots of different things still to come. If you're interested in any of that, subscribe down below. I'm going to open it all up on the channel. And I'm also going to be doing a giveaway for one of the Vivid Voltage booster boxes. So if you're interested in that, subscribe, and that'll be coming very, very soon. Give this video a like if you've liked it. It really helps the YouTube algorithm. I'm obviously a small channel, still trying to grow. So if you've liked it, give it a like. Um, and that's going to about do it for this video. Shining Fates is number one. I don't know what else to say. See you in the next video.